we are really in a no growth environment in terms of our GDP. Um, and this is despite some of the efforts that we saw last year in terms of government, business and labor working closer together um, and connecting in a much stronger way to try and change this environment, to try and stimulate growth um, through a package of, of, of reforms that all three parties would be committed to. High unemployment uh, continues to be a thorn in the side of, of our country, of South Africa. Uh, at almost 27%, uh, one can really uh, see that it's almost a, a ticking time bomb that we are sitting on in this country. If we don't lower that um, um, unemployment rate, uh, certainly it, it does not bode well for future economic growth um, of, of our country. Um, the effects of probably the worst drought on, on record in our country um, and the impact that that has had on food prices, food inflation, uh, is something that is, uh, again, there for all to see. Uh, and despite uh, some of the good or improved rains that we've seen in our country over the last four months or so, um, certainly the dam levels are nowhere near uh, where we want them to be. Um, and um, being a water-scarce country, uh, we certainly need uh, much more rain in order to reverse the impact of this, uh, of this drought. Then political and policy uncertainty. Um, uh, again, uh, a fairly active year in terms of politics and, and policy certainty last year. Um, we saw uh, some fairly uh, significant changes in the political discourse of our country uh, with the outcome of the municipal elections. Um, and it remains to be seen what impact, uh, if any, that will have on local economies, provincial economies, and on the whole country uh, as a whole. South African CEOs appear to be somewhat less optimistic um, than their global counterparts, um, at least over the short term. Um, on a more medium term basis, they do become a bit more optimistic, um, but certainly it appears there's a lot of uncertainty in the minds of a South African CEO about growth in the country, um, for, or a growth in the, in the global economy rather, um, for, for the next 12 months there continues to be um, slow growth uh, in the global economy um, in, in many respects. Um, this is um, something that we see in our very own country, South Africa, uh, where we are in a sub 1% growth uh, environment um, and something that you know, really isn't good for overall growth um, of the country. Uh, developed economies um, in a post-2008 environment we know have had a couple of tough years um, but that slow improvement that we started noting a year or two ago uh, continues to, to keep that momentum.